morning guys! Day 2 here in Costa Rica. It's a wonderful day here. It's not raining so the sky is blue. And the funny thing about here is that if you don't wake up by sunrise, the insects or the birds or the cows will wake you up. It's kind of funny because I haven't seen so much active wildlife uh, in the state. And also right when you wake up, you can see the volcano right behind me. So that's pretty cool. Not a sight that you see every day. So right now we're gonna head down for breakfast and uh, we're gonna head to the La Fortuna waterfall. That was a cow. And um, El Rio Salto, I think. From there, we're gonna drive up to Rio Celeste and do that tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, so that's the plan anyways. It may change, but that's what we have for today. So if you haven't subscribed, please make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any adventures. So let's get the day started. All right, guys, we have arrived to La Fortuna Waterfall. To get in is $18 per person. That's the parking area, and that behind me is where you buy your tickets. You can buy your tickets on demand. So now we're gonna go check it out. Right when you cross the bridge or right when you enter, there's uh, restrooms. And the trail is supposed to be 600 meters to the waterfall, about 20 to 30 minutes. Nice little gift shop here. Ooh, and there's some food here as well. We may try that later. Very thankful that during our stay we didn't get any rain. It's supposed to be raining every day in Costa Rica, but so far the days have been wonderful. The sky is blue and can't ask for anything better right now. And great company, of course. <laughs> steps to go back out and they do have this little spot that you can rest in between uh, because it is a lot of steps catch my breath here for a second we're almost we're almost there <laughs> you can do it mom <laughs> So right at the entrance of the waterfall, there is this uh, real lounge restaurant where we're gonna go drop a bite to eat right here. 
Our lunch has arrived. It looks yummy and delicious. Mom is having some chicken. <laughs> uh, but I can wheel the kite. Don't make the sound hotel. Hello guys, part two of today, uh, we are at Bulgarian Trail. It's supposed to be known for the sloths. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, so I put a picture up there so you guys know what, what I mean. The entrance to get here is $10 of self-guided. You can actually do tours here, but we just decided to do everything on our own. I hope I get to see some today, so let's get going. Estamos en recepción y va directo al puente 1. De aquí sugiero tomar su izquierda y hacer este sendero largo. Y cuando llegue a este, Si tomas la derecha, vuelve a recepción, izquierda vas a terminar en esta salida que está allá detrás de ustedes, al otro lado de la calle uh -huh. y luego nada más cruzas, vuelves aquí a recepción para hacer los senderos cortos si gustas. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. All right, this is the entrance, that's where you pay $10 and this is where you get started. There's one restroom only at the entrance. They build these little areas throughout the park so in the event that it rains you're covered because when it rains here it pours really bad so that was nice we are moving very slow because we're checking every tree out to see if we see the oso perezoso that's what you call it in spanish but so far no luck um i could have gotten a guy but i just wanted to see if i could do it on my own and I'm, I hope I do get lucky. Otherwise, we're not gonna leave this park unless we see one. At least one, right? No luck guys, we were not able to look at any uh, also perezosos, our necks are kind of sore right now, I've been looking up the whole time, so I think we're gonna have to bite the bullet and ask for help or ask for a guided tour. The sloth is right on the trunk, but it's very hard to see if you don't have binoculars. So this is the best I can do guys. Alright, so we're done with the sloth trail, at least I saw one, so um, I'm okay with that. Uh, we're gonna call it quits and we're gonna go drive to um, the Rio Celeste today. It's about an hour away. So we're gonna get some gas and hit the road. We have arrived to Rio Celeste. Rio Celeste is that way. Uh, we stopped here to get a bite to eat and possibly stay here at one of their cabins. Um, the uh, drive to get here was a little bit scary because the incline is pretty steep, but we made it. Uh, so now I'm just gonna get a bite, bite to eat and uh, and that's it for today. See you tomorrow. Bye. Hey guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for future adventures. See ya.